Okay, so this tutorial is how you can edit your intros and your endings uh, for your free templates. Now, I have the volume turned down on the music because if I talk and then the music plays, it's going to be an awful sound. But anyway, you, I'm just going to play. So that's, that's an intro right there. That's an example of an intro template that you can put at the beginning of your videos. Now I'm going to show you how you can basically take your video and put text on it, put your logo in there. Um, so here we go. All right. Now the first thing is I use Cyber, CyberLink PowerDirector, but whether you have Windows Movie Maker, Sony Vegas, or anything, uh, if you have a computer nowadays, you're going to have some kind of editing software, and they pretty much all are very, very similar. There may be some different features, uh, but if you kind of look at this tutorial and then do a little bit of research on your own uh, software that you have, you should be able to figure it out. So the first thing I'm going to do is um, I'm going to pull in, and I'm not going to worry too much about design today, guys, like making it look incredible. I, I'm just going to show you how to do it, and then you can get as creative as you want. But first thing I'm doing right here is I'm going up to File and Import because I want to put in my logo, okay? We're going to put in my logo. Uh, so I'm basically going on my computer to desktop, that's where I have my logo. I'm going to look for it, there it is. And I'm going to pull it in, see? Alright, so I'm pulling it in. And another thing, I'm going to want to add text, but let's let's get the logo on there first. So what, I, what do I do? I take this, I'm going to drag it in to the second area, and you start to see it uh, appear. Now it's overtaken this. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to shrink it. See what I did there? I basically grabbed that. Now there's there's my logo right there. Okay, I can make it come in at any time too. Let's say in the beginning I don't want it to show. So you see I'm down here with my hand. I just want to show you that move again. See I'm I'm here with my mouse. I bring it down here. I'm going to grab it and bring it over a little bit. So maybe again the beginning. Let's make sure the volume's turned down. Yeah, it's turned down. So in the beginning it's not going to be there and then it's going to appear. Watch this. So you can see it's not there and then all of a sudden there it is okay so you can do things like that you can fade it in you can do different things you can uh, I'll be making lots of tutorials uh, as far as getting to advanced stuff I just want to teach you guys basic stuff you can be doing alright so we've got we've got that in there now we want to cut it at the end so it so it's not going to take the whole thing so I'm coming here and I'm just gonna reach this out again what I did is I grabbed up here until it became yellow reached it out and when that's highlighted that's gonna allow me to make a cut so there's the cut okay looks like it's it's not enough but um so you play with that until it ends just right okay now for the text right to Maybe I want to put my website down there, your email address, your phone number, and you can put text all over, anywhere you want. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this right here where we have our title room, and I'm just going to pull down this. Well, i got to actually create a third right here you see this plus sign this can add an additional track so I'm going to add additional track below track 2 and then I'm going to drag this down into 3 so I've got my title now I basically double click on it Sometimes you just have to keep clicking on this thing. It's 
can be frustrating. Okay. And now I can start to work with it. You can you can also change your you'll have ability to change the kind of font you use. So your software should allow you lots of choices. I kind of always like uh, Arial Black. I kind of like that. So we'll use Arial Black. Let's take a look at that color. Let's maybe this one. What do you think? So you can play around with the looks you like. Again, you all have slightly, if you have different software, you have slightly different choices. You can also customize it, but for it to be easy, we'll uh, we'll play with what we've been given. All right, so out of everything so far, I think maybe I like this one. I'm going to use that. All right, and just for the sake of the video, we'll use the website. We'll put our website down. Again, you can use whatever you want. Crunch time coaching.com. You can see that that's too big right now. Let's see if I drag it, if we can make it work. Looks like we can. That's actually going to look pretty cool, huh? All right. And Again, we can we can also do some cool stuff. We can make it appear in different ways. So let's take a look at this. Let's see. Do we want to appear is kind of how you have your your intros. Again, yours may be look a little different, but you should have this kind of uh, these kind of choices. Let's make it glow in. I like it to glow in. So just play around with the different choices you have. Oh, look at that. Oh, that's cool. So that's how it's going to appear. I'm going to hit OK. OK, so then we just play it. And now this is what we have for an intro.